Hi, I'm Brittany Ober with Terry Vision. I'm here with head coach Jim Garrity. Coach, not the cleanest game, but what got y'all the win tonight? Well, um, you give Western Carolina a lot of credit. Um, they run some really good stuff. Their five out was hard to guard for us, and um, and and they made plays. I, I thought defensively we made some mistakes, um, but uh, you know give them a lot of credit that they converted on our mistakes. Um, I thought down the stretch um, we spread them out a little bit more and. Uh, and got some good, clean, open looks, which was really good. I thought we pressed there uh, uh, in the second half towards the end of the third quarter, and I thought that slowed them up some too. Um, so, But I, I'll give our players, um, I, I'm really, really proud of them for, it was a grinded out type game. You know, every time you looked up, it was like by eight, nine, 10 points. We just never really could stretch it out till late in the fourth. Yeah, I'm gonna touch on the defense for a second. It looked very good tonight. The Western didn't see the line very much. Yeah, they, they didn't, um, but they, they got some players, um, you know, uh, 30 and LaPlante. Um, they're two really, really good players, and, and they made us play, uh, pay. Um, they hit some tough contested threes, which uh, really kept them in the game. And so a lot of them were late shot clocks, so we're playing great defense for 25 seconds, and they hit a big shot. I talked to you before the game, and you said you wanted to see the girls trust themselves, trust their shots. How important is their confidence? Yeah, you know, I, I just wanted them to – to do what they do best you know don't try to be somebody that you're not and do extra things and I thought they you know they did that and um, they're a good team we've got some good players and when we play together and we're um, you know we're dialed into the scouting report typically we're pretty hard to beat what's the practice plan going into Saturday you know it's a quick turnaround you know so these Thursday Saturday games are, are tough uh, tomorrow will be really light. Uh, we'll get some shots up, and then we'll go over uh, UNC Greensboro. I'm here with Cairo Booker. Cairo, tonight you broke your career high with 25 points. What does that feel like? Um, it's just a great feeling. It's even it's an even better feeling knowing that we got the win out of it and just knowing that I have good teammates that support me and what I do and that are confident in my ability to play. So it's just exciting. And you knew on paper that y'all should probably win this game, but as a leader, how do you t keep the team grounded and just play basketball? Well, you can't go into any game underestimating them, and this was a big conference win for us considering that we've never won on a Thursday. So I just had to keep you know, putting that in the back of their heads and that we all had to play hard to get our first Thursday win. So. I was listening, on, listening in on the huddles, and I heard you yelling, energy, guys, energy. Like, how important is that energy on the court? Energy is what gets us going. It's the team with the most energy that usually wins the ball game. So it's just important to keep the energy high and making sure that everybody stays on their best game and executes. I'm here with Deja Green. Deja, great win tonight. You got a double-double. How well were you playing? Um, I think uh, my teammates gave me a lot of confidence tonight. Uh, my, my shot wasn't really falling how I wanted it to. However, my teammates were knocking down shots, so I was able to get them involved a lot, and they were knocking them down. Y'all's defense is on tonight. What did you think of the guarding? Um, I think we picked it up a lot in the fourth quarter. Um, we came out in a 1-2 to two press, and it was really important for us to slow them down a little bit. Um, Western moves a lot in their offense, and they kind of move nonstop. Um, so it, was, it would be easier for us to guard them with maybe 18 or 20 left on the shot clock rather than a full 30 seconds. Big game on Saturday against UNCG. What do you want to take from this game into that game? I think the biggest thing going into UNCG is going to be rebounding. Um, they have a lot of tall players, and they play very physical. It's going, to be, it's going to be important for us to make sure we crash the glass and don't give them any second-chance opportunities.